It's always great when the mascots and cheerleaders get together. Whoa! Engulfed! That's not right. You got an Alka-Seltzer? <laughs> That's some serious indigestion here in Nashville. We have been assured by the Tennessee Titans that all the cheerleaders are okay. <laughs> Westbrook able to get inside again. Peyton didn't think he was going to go left. But Triano said that, that he can get into those mismatches and big. Runner goes from first base and it's hit toward Kinsler. Great play. He's going to throw it home with the runner not coming and the bases are loaded. Man. Runner on the move and Lori pretty much was standing. Tough, tough runner when he's in the backfield. Menchier unloads. Pass is caught and then a big hit delivered. Taylor. Go deep down the far sideline. It is incomplete off the fingertips of Zay Jones. Coming on the year is Paulie Fricano. Fricano is six of eight now. Off the crossbar. He just barely had enough, but he knocked it through, Ben. Eastern Michigan answers. Three to three. Five yards. The kick is up. It is. Off the upright and out! It hit the upright twice, then the crossbar and stayed out. Detected, nowhere to throw it until now. What a catch, and now batted around and caught by Parker. In and out of the hands of Grant, and when he was hit... So a high school football player shared a video of him tackling his own teammate. Oh, so here it no. is. Well, the other player made a great interception, but he ran the wrong direction. So there he goes. You see his own guy chasing him down here. He tackles <laughs> him at the 10. Oh, no. <laughs> Someone on the sidelines right there is just losing it. That would have been a, a safety. I agree. It would have been two points for the other team had he made it all the way to the end zone. I, so Get tough. The fouls on the play. Unnecessary, after the play was over, unnecessary roughness on number 52. Excuse me a minute. Okay. Mike, this is like a <laughs> like a want to get this away is, commercial. Yeah, this is like a wing commercial. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Hold on a second. I'll be right back. He's not laughing. Who says these officials take themselves too seriously? At least he smiled. He did. Laugh. He did. There are I like multiple him. fouls on the play. Unnecessary roughness <laughs> on the kicking team number 92. 52. <laughs> Unnecessary roughness on the receiving team, number 57. Those fouls offset. There's also a holding, number 92, on the return team. All those fouls offset at the spot of that foul. First down, kick, uh, Dallas. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I don't know where the ball is. start at it. Look at this, folks. 6'3", 325 pounds. Snap it, actually. Colt Anderson is behind him. And Mark, what in the world? You got a guy on either side of him. What are you doing here? There's a plane coming down onto the field, folks, right now. We got a crazy landing going on. Here it comes right onto the field, right behind the field. And it's on fire. No way did that just happen, folks. And everybody running over there now to see if they can help somebody. My goodness. Yeah, be careful because we saw some flames go up. You don't want that thing to blow up over there. 
What a crazy event, folks. We're so used to seeing the planes here. So it didn't seem like much, and then it just got real close. Oh, boy. Runs the deep in route, and the ball pops out of his hands, so it's up for grabs. This is what they call a tip drill for defensive back. Hill misses. Rebound goes to the Cavs. J.R. Smith brings it back out. Throws it to Hill. Hill shot blocked. Great job from Smith to get the rebound, but dribble it away. He's got some skills now. At the 26, Palmer over the middle. Nice grab there by Moore again at the 20-yard line. Gets up and runs the wrong way. <laughs> I think he kind of lost his place on the field. Who was that? Roy, Roy Riggles? Wrong way Riggles? Yeah, Remember Jim him? Marshall. Rose Bowl, Jim Marshall, yeah. Good route crossing the face of Chris Harris. And then you go the other way. <laughs> <laughs> oh. He's not sure he's touched. He's excited. It's kind of like when you do a bunch of somersaults in the pool and you end up hitting your head on the bottom instead of coming up to the top. <laughs> Someone has said... Somebody in a parachute has just landed on the edge of the ring, has been pulled away by security guards. The fight has been brought to a halt. There's a massive melee at ringside as this fellow with a motorized parachute has landed right on top of spectators and officials at ringside. He's in the midst of a mass of security guards now. Rock Newman, Riddick Bowe's manager, was right there. This is a monumental disaster. Right now, police are filing by me at ringside and grabbing this gentleman who has created a monstrosity of an interruption in the bout. His parachute has caught itself up on a row of ring lights. Now, we're going to take a look at an earlier shot of the parachutist earlier this evening from our blimp coverage. As this took place, we are told that our blimp cameraman tried to alert us to the possibility that this was going to happen. That's why he was zooming in and out, as you can see here. And there it is. He targeted the ring and came right down. Well, this guy is going to wind up in the slammer in Vegas tonight, and with doggone good reason. What charges, I wonder? What charges? Yeah. <laughs> Doing an outrageous thing to get some publicity for himself. Oh. Five. And now, whoa, what happened here? The same thing, it's the Burger King guy. What is going on? There's a fan on the field. He took the snap. <laughs> this is incredible. And now the fan is wrapped up by security. And the unbolt team seconds to play. In with time. Throw for the end zone. It is intercepted at the goal line. Brad Lewis intercepted. Lost the football. That is a touchdown or is it? It's got to be. Golden comes. He's trying to keep him in the end zone. Oh, just pops it right out. You play 59 minutes and 53 seconds to get a play like this. Fifty to go, and Melangeni is holding on. Alfonso on his shoulder. Zalani's not out of it either. It's anybody's race. Can anyone catch Melangeni? Oh, maybe somebody can. Is that our cameraman? He's matching him stride for stride. He's.